This is Fred Beck from Frederick's Fighting, proudly sponsored by Empire Firestone, joined once again by promoter Eddie Hearn. Eddie, it's nice to see you again, mate. All's been well with you? All is good, mate. I'm just a bit concerned because Derek Chisora's in the ring. You know, anything can happen when this, this happens, but, uh, you know, we'll have to see. Looking forward to Saturday night. Kubrat Pulev against Anthony Chisora, massive fight. Uh, Anthony Chisora? Derek Chisora. Derek Chisora, massive fight, and uh, looking forward to it. Do you ever get a little bit nervous when you when you promote Derek? Yeah, yeah. very much so. I mean, they just did a head to head there, and I didn't actually know about the head to head, and it nearly went off. So we'll have to see what happens at the press tomorrow. Are there any fighters you also promote who you get a little bit nervous around when you're kind of facing them off? Just Derek. Just Derek. Yeah, because he's so vulnerable. Like vulnerable, he's so volatile. Unpredictable. Yeah, volatile is the word. He's just anything can happen with him, and you just always got to be on on the, uh, you know, on the on the. I mean, now he's doing musical chairs for his public workout. Like, I just, I don't... Do you not feel like getting in there at all? No. Do you? No, no. <laughs> you never know what he's going to do. That's, that's the worrying thing. Of course. And so talking about the fight on Saturday night, how important is a win here for Derek? Must win. Absolute must win. You know, it's a situation where he's got to get in there and, and win. Everyone talks about the defeats. And he is losing to elite level guys. But he's got to win this fight. And uh, he's got a very tough task against this man who's big and strong. And he's a world-class heavyweight in Kubrat Pulev. I've got a question for you about being a promoter. When you promote someone on their debut in their last fight, does it ever make you feel a little bit old? Yeah, it does actually, but it's very rewarding. Like, you want to always... Yeah, satisfaction. Around. Yeah, of course, because you take a fight... When we came into the sport, there's a lot of criticism about, oh, they don't know how to take a fighter through. Well, we've done it multiple times with fighters now from their debut to the World Championship and unification, so it's, uh, it's very rewarding. Okay, that's quite nice then. Who do you think you felt that you promoted which is the most rewarding fighter, the most pleased with their career, that you kind of started? Probably Tony Bell, you know, because he was, you know, he ended up making a career for himself that many thought wasn't possible, so I have to say Tony. Okay. And just your thoughts on Jake Paul 23 not going ahead, is that kind of disappointing or do you not really care? That's what it is, you know, um, I'm sure they'll find another fight. And Hassi Rockman Jr., that's his opponent? Good choice of fight for Jake Paul. Good choice of fight. Thanks, Eddie.